health is a term that can mean many things and can be used in a large variety of ways. In health and physical education, this specialized term does not merely refer to the absence of disease, but incorporates the physical, social, emotional, mental, and spiritual wellness of an individual, group, or population. There are many factors that affect an individual's health and well being. And to help understand these factors, they can be categorized into different health dimensions. The six dimensions of health are physical, emotional, intellectual, social, spiritual, and environmental. Each dimension of health incorporates many factors that can negatively or positively affect health. And each can be analyzed looking for ways a person might improve their all round health and well being. The environmental health dimension includes factors that affect health as a result of the external situation and circumstances in which the individual finds themselves. This dimension incorporates a range of factors including the physical environment of the individual, do they live in a rural or suburban area with available green space or natural areas free from pollution, or are they residing in high density housing in an urban location? The home environment. What is the makeup of the family, extended family, and living situation? And what are their attitudes towards health and well being? Financial conditions. Does the individual have access to money for life's essentials? Do they have disposable income for leisure and health activities? Access to health resources. Does the individual live close to adequate health services and can they access these? Not just hospitals but access to first responders and council and community services and resources. And the work or school environment. Is this a flexible environment that allows for personal needs, changing life circumstances and financial requirements? Does the environment encourage learning and personal growth and provide a sense of fulfillment and accomplishment? As environmental health relates to how external factors affect health, it can be difficult to maximize this health dimension without significant life changes. For example, moving house, relocating to a different region or changing careers. As a result, it can be difficult to influence this health dimension for children who may have little or no control over these factors. Some tips to help optimize environmental health include making use of the green spaces available to you. Getting in touch with nature provides many positive health benefits. Assist to keep Australia beautiful. Be an advocate for your local environment to ensure green space is retained and is free of pollution. Be aware and utilize your local health care facilities so that they are retained as essential services for everyone. Help to maintain a safe school or work environment by following guidelines and meeting expectations and develop financial literacy to maximize the financial resources that you receive.